Hi guys, I am back again. I'm doing another video. This video is actually um, going to be titled "What's in the Name." Um, I just sat here and I thought about it because a lot of people ask me, "Oh, Jordan, uh, why did you name her Jordan?" Or isn't that a boy's name? Or stuff like that. So let me just address this. <laughs> I'm going to be quick video, but I thought it was necessary. Um, so yes, my baby girl's name is Jordan Simone, okay, last name doesn't really matter guys, I don't know, I don't know the people out here, so I'm not going to put that out there, but yeah, Jordan Simone, spelled J-O-R-D-Y-N, Simone, S-Y-M-O-N-E. Now Jordan is the female version to Jordan, J-O-R-D-A-N, um, it's definitely a unisex name. I went with Jordan because I felt it was unique. Unlike myself, being named Tiffany, I run into like a million Tiffany's. I go through my call log, or, I mean my contact list on my phone, and it's like five or ten of them. Um, I meet people. Name is Tiffany, Jessica, Kimberly, other common names, Mary. And I just didn't want that for her. Like, I wanted my name to be unique, but, you know, my mom was just like, I like Tiffany. So, that's what my name is. But, um, yeah, for all my children, if there's more, I told you uh, the way this pregnancy is going, I don't see it happening anytime soon, at least. But, um, yeah, I want them to all have unique names. Um, so, yeah, so that, that's why I chose Jordan, because it was unique, unisex, and also um, the meaning. So the meaning of Jordan, and I'm sorry I have a long, long um, meaning here. I'm going to just read it to you guys. It means that the person, you know, Jordan, the person is honest. If you're an honest person. But sometimes when you voice your opinion, people get hurt by it. So be careful. Um, all Jordans are good at giving advice. So if there's a problem, talk to them. Um, they will die protecting their friends. They're uh, pretty protective of their, of their circle, their close-knit circle. And it also means that Jordan means flowing or to descend, and people named Jordan love to have friends. So, you know, I looked it up on a couple of different sites, but this is pretty much captivated the entire, you know, meaning of the name Jordan. Um, Simone is tagged on pretty much because my middle name is Simone. Just the spelling is different. Mine is I M O N E. Hers is Y M O N E. M O Y M O N E. Um. So I just like the way it sounds. The agreement is nice. That's why I just said, why well, not pass on my name to her? So, dudes do it all the time to their sons. Why can't I just throw my middle name? Throw her name. My name in there is her middle name. So, that's what I did. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Now, I don't know how you guys feel, but I, put it, I, don't, I have been getting positive responses, actually, about her name. Um, you know, most of the time, the people who say, isn't that a boy name? Those like the older people. And I mean the older people, I mean like the elderly. Because <laughs> like my grandmother's friends be like, Jordan, you said it's a, a girl, right? I'm like, yes. How are these people? I didn't say Tony. I think that's more like boyish. It, it can go both ways, Tony Braxton, of course. But I think that's more like boy than Jordan. But I don't know. But, um, yeah, so I don't know how you guys feel about it, but I'm not changing it. I'm just saying, I just, you know, I just want you guys' opinions. Like, what do you think? I don't know. I like it. Um, and that's what it's going to be. But, um, yeah, but I'm just wanting to give you guys a reasoning, you know, for my name choice. And also, give, shed some insight on, 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 on you guys as far as when you choose the name or when you're brainstorming for your child. Don't stick to the norm. I like to step out the box, Okay. I don't have Bonquisha, Alfonja, you know, those ghetto, excuse me, names um, for my child. That's that's something different. But unique, simple, um, subtle, um, something with meaning, hopefully, uh, are good choices. So if you're thinking of something, but you're more concerned about how it's going to be perceived by society, no, forget that. <laughs> You go with what you like. So hopefully you guys um, have names already or, um, and even if it's a common name, that's what your choice is. There's a reason for everything. Maybe your mom or somebody significant in your life or somebody who passed away has a name. And you want to just, you know, um, 
continue their legacy and just have that name flowing down through your family tree. That's perfectly fine. That's your reasoning for it. But don't not do something because you're worried about other people. Please. I hate that. Um, but yeah, guys. That's about it. I just felt like I had to get it off my chest. <laughs> and, um, yeah. So, that's it. You guys can leave comments. Hit me with any questions because I'm going to try to answer the questions that I have in my inbox by next week. And then, oh, excuse me. And when I mean questions, I mean questions as far as... Oh, okay. God. Oh, God. He's so uh, unprofessional, YouTube-wise. Y'all don't like this, but I'm tired. Um, yeah, questions related to, you know, um, to me. Like me, my personal life. How do I feel about labor or uh, different questions like that. So I'm going to be answering some of those if not next week, then definitely this weekend, sooner. So, be looking out for that. But for now, guys, be safe. If you haven't watched my 37-week update, do that. If you have watched my 37-week update, hopefully you're watching this one. Comment, subscribe, leave a message, whatever. Alright, guys, talk to you later. Bye.